Hi guys, this is Victor from webautomation.io and in this video, I will be showing you how to scrape grocery products from tesco.com, which is one of the biggest grocery retailers in the UK. Uh, the first thing you need to do is head over to webautomation.io um, and then you need to sign up for an account. Uh, if you already have one, you need to sign in I'm already signed in. So I'm gonna head straight into the dashboard. And in this video, I'm going to be using uh, Web Automation's uh, Get Started Wizard. The Get Started Wizard is the easier, quicker way to create an extractor from scratch. So I'm going to go Get Started. And then I, it takes me to the marketplace, which has hundreds of web scrapers but I'm gonna search for Tesco. Now you can see the two Tesco web scrapers. One web scraper will scrape more details from the product pages. The other one will scrape just the details available on the search pages. So for this video, I will use the product page web scraper. Now activate. So it's already given us a category, a URL in here. Uh, but what we need to do is get another URL from Tesco's. So I'm going to head back into Tesco's. Um, I'm already on a fresh foods category. You can use any category um, available on Tesco, or you could also do a search and just copy that URL, head back into web automation, put it in there, and then you can put the number of results you want to get save, and you're good to go. Confirm you're happy to go ahead. And then voila, that's it. The extractor started running. And in a few moments, we'll be able to see a preview of the data. Um, and then we can actually look at the data and see if we're happy. So we got a notification and our data is ready to download. So we can have a look in the preview and see what the data would look like. Uh, looks all good. Then we can download as a CSV, XML, Excel, or JSON. I'm going to open up in Excel. Save on my local. Uh, let's see what we have. So we have the name of the product, we have the price, currency, uh, price per quantity. Um, so we've got most of the details that we wanted. If we're happy with the data. Um, I've just shown you guys very quickly how you can extract data from uh, Tesco in just a few minutes using the web automation uh, predefined extractors. I'll just show you guys a little bit more about the tool if I head back into Web Automation, close the wizard. And now this is the full view. So we can see, you can do a little bit more. Uh, you can see how long the extractors took. You can download again. You can rerun. You can even input and change the URL. Um, and you can do a lot more as well. So thank you guys for watching the video and I can't wait to see what you guys extract from Tesco. I'll see you at the next video. Goodbye.